Several sources report that CyberLife has provided Detroit police with a prototype detective android. Although police assistant androids have existed for several years now, this would be the first case of an android being authorized to play an active role in criminal investigations. We contacted CyberLife for comment, but no longer. What's going on guys, welcome back to Detroit Become Human episode 14 with me CXC in this episode we're going to be jumping in and continuing the story off as Marcus. So yeah there's a new episode on Detroit every 6 days, new video on the channel every other day so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all of the content that's going to be dropping. We've got plenty of series running on the channel, we've got the Assassin's Creed Valhalla series, Destiny 2 and Detroit Become Human. When one series finishes, a new series begins in its place, so there's always new content added. But yeah, we're going to be pushing forward as Marcus. We've got a few cutscenes that we just had to watch initially. We're looking for some symbols, so I think we're just going to be going around the map trying to find these graffiti. Don't know exactly what it looks like. Okay, there we go. Okay, so we found a symbol so far. Is he right? Oh yeah, sure. I'll talk to you later. Sorry, excuse me. Okay, so I guess in this episode, there's not too much interaction with other characters. I think it's more just finding these symbols. So I'm going to try and keep it as uncut as possible. I'm just going to edit out anything that's necessary like if we're just walking with no interaction or anything maybe we need to make our way to the next symbol okay, let's find out where we've got to go Okay, so this looks like the building to me. I'm pretty sure that it's here. So we're looking for the symbol. One there. And the second one is there. There we go. Okay, so that's two of two. Now we're moving on to the next symbol. Which is where? I haven't got a clue where it wants us to go. I thought there was a trail. They were meant to follow. At least we're getting a look at the world. Like the world does look really nice. We're blending in quite well. Okay, so... 
Alright guys, so we're gonna look for this and I'll be right back once we've got closer to it. Okay, that took so much longer than I expected. But yeah, we found the next location. We've got to find three symbols. Looks like that's one there. Okay, we need to get around there and move that, I'm pretty sure. So we'll make our way through the fence. Hopefully no one's looking. And yeah, we've got to move this pallet. And then I'm pretty sure that we can scan the symbol. Okay, so there we go, we found the next lot of symbols, there's one. And I'm pretty sure we need to go onto the roof to the left. Yeah, find a way to reach, find a way to reach the roof, okay. So we're going to have to find something to climb up on. I think we can use this, yeah, there we go. So we're going to grab this, pull it into the right position. We're going to climb up onto the roof and collect the rest of these symbols. Probably not the most exciting episode, but I guess we are doing a lot of world exploring and stuff. At least we're finding out something about the map. Right, so we found two of three. Where's the third? You know, I hate doing symbol stuff because they could be in the most obvious place, and I'm just not sure where they are. Like, I'm sure this is really obvious. I'm missing something. Right, let's keep looking, let's keep looking. It's staring me in the face and I know it. It's not that side. Not down there. Okay, so there's two. Where is this third symbol? Okay, we can't jump over there or anything. The third symbol's definitely here. But where? Alright, I'm going to keep looking because this can make me look stupid. I'm going to keep looking, guys. And once we find the third symbol, I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm still not 100% sure where this third symbol is. We're just going to have another little look at this from afar. Try our best to try and get hold of the symbol. Am I being an idiot? Or... You know, I really can't see it, that's the thing. Okay. This is definitely dragging on more than I expected. Let's go really slow, section by section. What? How is that there? That doesn't even make any sense. Okay, so we can jump over this now. Now we're on to the next symbol, we can move forward. That's if we make this jump, it's quite a distance. Use the right stick to select the route. Okay, so that would not be working. What's the next option? Boom. And boom. Okay, so this has got a pretty good success rate. We're going to try that. 
That's pretty cool. I don't think I've been introduced to that feature just yet. But yeah, we've got to try and find the other symbols anyway. I don't know if this has got anything to do with that RA9 or whatever it's called that we were introduced to in the last episode when we were playing as Marcus. There's one that was pretty easy to find. Where is the second one now? You know, I'm not spotting these at all. They're so... There we go, that's all right. We got lucky with that second one. I don't think I would have got that that quick. Okay, so we've got to make our way inside. Okay, that would not be working. That would not be solid enough. I don't know why I keep saying that would not be working instead of that would not work. Because I start reading what he says. Okay, and from here we go. Boom. He's got the strength to do that, I'm sure. Would be too high. Okay. Let's try the ladder way. It looks like that's the most successful route to go with. Okay, so let's try and execute that. It's been a really fun mission, to be honest. When it started, I thought it was going to be really slow. And quite boring, but it's actually been really fun. I don't know if that came across on the footage, but... I've definitely enjoyed it, if no one else has. Okay, so now we're looking for the next graffiti. I'm going to try and find the symbols within this wall. Looks like it's one of those ones where you have to stand at a certain position to catch it. Yeah, we've got to get this pillar involved. There we go, that's one of one symbol updated. So we found all the symbols that we need to find. And we're looking for the next graffiti. Okay, so this game just looks way too good for a 2018 title. I still can't get over the graphics on this. They're just insane. I'm trying to let it be cinematic without talking so much over it, by the way. So, um, yeah, that's why there's quiet times. It's more just enjoying the scenery and stuff. Okay, so we're climbing up the ladder. We'll make our way up the top here. So I guess we're now underground. Not sure what we're gonna uncover here.
Okay guys, so I think that's pretty much it for this episode. Make sure to join me in six days time for episode 15, where I think we're going to be playing as Connor. We played as Kara in the last episode, we're playing as Marcus, so yeah, I think it's Connor that we're picking up. I think we're picking up as Connor in the next episode, but yeah, that's going to do it for me. Hopefully you enjoyed, make sure to subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next episode.